walking through Calgary's downtown west side not long after my concussion and waiting at the tracks as a train thundered past. There seemed no end to the tankers and boxcars. The sound and vibrations overwhelmed me and I steeled my body and clenched my teeth and I began to get a headache. This train, this stupid train was draining me. And then I thought, what if I give in? What if I become loose as a rag doll? I let the shock and clatter rumble through me and the strangest thing happened. The energy of the train bled into me. It was so unexpected. I've had three concussions. My first one I got when I was skiing on the top of a hill in British Columbia and I broke my neck and when I landed I cracked my head uh, on the snow but there was no brain damage and my second concussion was when I rolled out the back of my van in a manual wheelchair and my chair flipped over. So when I had my concussion I was going backwards down this in my wheelchair which you have to do when you load up which is just like this. So in my manual chair I got in And my manual chair is a lot smaller. And as I was going up, it flipped me back right about here onto the concrete, onto the back of my skull. And I got a very bad concussion and I still suffer from it all the time. Living in a wheelchair can be treacherous. It's extremely risky. You're rolling around in an upright position. Imagine, pushing your dining room chair all over the place. We all know that chairs fall backwards. They fall everywhere. And sitting in a chair is not the best position to be moving fast along a road or a sidewalk with various bumps and different aspects of the terrain that might be difficult to navigate. There are good reasons why people in wheelchairs have problems with concussions and brain injury. And the other part is that for most of us, a lot of us anyways, um, our bodies aren't working normally, so we don't have the muscle strength and the muscle power to call upon muscles to hold ourselves up to basically counteract the bump or somebody hitting us or uh, a divot in the road. And so gravity is not on our side. Mm -hmm.